Today, we will explore how the Kerala School in India laid the foundations of calculus long before Newton and Leibniz. First, let's journey to 14th century India, where the Kerala Gurukul was pioneering advancements in mathematics. These scholars developed the concept of the infinite series, a cornerstone of calculus around 1350. Their work didn't just stop there. They calculated the value of pi with astonishing accuracy. This was a monumental feat, considering the era's limited mathematical tools. But why haven't we heard of these mathematical trailblazers? Colonialism and language barriers played a role in silencing their story. Most of their work was documented in Malayalam, a local language, making it inaccessible to the wider world until recent times. Thanks to historians in the recent times, the Kerala Gurukul's contributions are finally coming to light. But the real question is, did the Indian discoveries actually influence European mathematics? Well, there's compelling evidence suggesting that Jesuit missionaries in India could have been the conduit. These missionaries, present in Kerala during the 15th century, were well-versed in both mathematics and local languages. Their involvement in global scientific efforts, including the Catholic Church's calendar reform, might have been the bridge that brought this knowledge to Europe. The University of Manchester and other academic institutions are now acknowledging these contributions, part of a broader movement to recognize non-Western scientific achievements. This recognition is crucial for an inclusive history that celebrates diverse mathematical traditions. This revelation has forced us to rethink the history of calculus. Not only that, India is rewriting its history with the creation of this large temple that will last 2,500 years without any steel. How is this possible? Check it out. It's mesmerizing. <laughs>